Hello, this is Heavy Thrash and that's my vlog channel like YouTube. So, this is a Nasty Metal Productions channel announcement video. So I'm going to be talking about uh, what to expect from U.S. Power Metal Month, which takes place April, right from uh, April 1st all the way to April 30th, which is, of course, April 1st being on a Friday with, um, you know, actually, it yeah, with uh, being on a Friday and then April 30th being on like a Saturday. I might have got that wrong, who knows. You always can correct me in the comment section down below. So, what to expect? Well, I'm mostly going to be focusing on the U.S. power metal albums of the 80s. Everything starting with 1983. The reason is, to me, I feel that's when mostly of the U.S. power metal bands were coming out on that uh, year. To me, that's when the sound was definitely starting to really a bit come to itself. And I know, you're going to be thinking, why aren't you going to be talking about Man of War? I don't have to. I don't have to explain myself. I don't. I'm not against the band. I do like some of their albums. Maybe I probably should talk about Battle Hymns, which is probably my favorite from them. But I think they're a band that has been talked about a lot. And I think the U.S. Power Month should be focusing on bands that either get some talk or ones that normally don't get a whole lot of talk. And, you know, some it's, it's better to give bands that don't have too much attention. Who knows, you might think I'm a hypocrite during the month, but it's just my personal, uh, you know, being. It, it, it's my personal uh, opinions, my personal picks. It, it, it's just, again, it's all through feeling. It's what, you know... So, besides that... It will all be within albums that are either favorites, ones that I kind of like, and want, and also some new ones I'll check out that kind of maybe deserve, you know, um, some talk. Again, that deserves some attention. And maybe that might give the band even more attention. Definitely, um, definitely going to be good. And But, I will end you... Ugh, burped. <laughs> However, it's going to be ending on a climatic note. It's like, throughout the whole month, there's going to be review after review after review. And I'll probably throw in some uh, reviews for some new releases, if I can fit those in. Again, there's going to be a bit of a tight scheduling. I can't do everything at once. So... <laughs> Wow, this is a, um, something. This is definitely a, uh, funny, uh, announcement video. Wow, what a shock. So, again, it's going to be filled with reviews. If I can fit, uh, some new, uh, albums in here within the schedule for the month, I can. There's a lot of albums to talk about, though. Though I had to cut some albums out, but still... I can always can talk about it maybe in a last video, which is going to end because on uh, April 30th, will or April 31st? Yeah, I think it's April 31st. Is there a 31st within April? Maybe. I can't. It, it isn't coming to my video. I can't script these announcement videos. These videos are not meant to be scripted. Maybe you remember them, but I can't always remember everything. I can't always do second or third takes, for Christ's sakes. Ugh. So, like again, um, it's going to be ending with lists. Like a uh, top 15 best U.S. power metal EPs of the 80s. 
and the top 30 or 40 depending what's on my mind unless you want to see a top 40 or top 50 best US power metal albums of the 1980s if you want to see a top 50 you go spam that in the comment section I want to see you depending if you want to see 30 40 or 50 I could do 20 but since there's so many great U.S. power metal albums out there that were, uh, you know, released in the 80s, I can't fit everything in. So you have to kind of let me know in the comment section on what you, what type of list you want to see. You like again, you got your picks: top 30, top 40, or top 50. Pick between those three, damn it. Pick the pick between those three. So, I don't want to uh, drag this whole video too long, but this is definitely a great month, and I'm definitely want to get your takes, your answers on some of this as well. What albums you want to see me review? I know I've got some laid out, but what? Uh, like uh, the, uh, I can also you know take like um, requests. There we go. Request maybe a album that was released in the eighties that is U.S. power metal sounding. Is there an album that that's been a favorite of yours that is U.S. power metal that you want to see me review during this month? You put also that in the comments, and also post what you what type of uh, you know format best of list you want to see. Again, I'm going to run it down. 30, 40, or 50. Then I can also can put that in the uh, description uh, box. So, I hope uh, this was definitely informative for you all. For you all 59 or maybe 60 subscribers of mine, which I'm very thankful for. I'm very happy that, that I have uh, about 59 subscribers at this point. Really, it's great that that's his channel is actually getting, um, you know, hopefully I, I can get um, more viewers and more uh, subscribers. And I have a Facebook page and everything like that. I'm on uh, you know, forums. Maybe. I don't know how many forums. Alright, I'm dragging this episode too long. Or announcement video. I'll see you on U.S. Power Metal Month in April. See you later. Ugh.